Hey chickies, we're going to be chatting all about top summer essentials. These are the tried and true holy grail status products are must-haves during the summertime season or summertime but we also have some new additions so if you're new here i'm christine would really appreciate it and would love if you would please subscribe to be a part of the chicky crew also don't forget to hit that bell to be notified of new videos and if you guys enjoyed this type of video please make sure you give this video a like it really does help out this channel so much please don't really forget to comment below some of your top essential items whether it's skincare sunblock an accessory would love to hear what some of your top essentials are for the summertime such a stickler when it comes to spf spf on the face on the body Primarily, I would say the face. That's the one where I always concentrate the most. And sometimes, you know, I'm gonna admit it, sometimes I forget about the body and the neck, which is very important. Now, the very first one, which I know I've talked about for the past couple years, but it still is one of the top tier products holy grail status and it's from the brand Hawaiian Tropic Silk Hydration Lotion Sunscreen. It's a weight. It's weightless, it also contains broad spectrum SPF 50, and it also provides 12 hours of moisturization. Now the thing I love about this, love the scent of this because it just smells very tropical, very beachy. I know not everybody is a fan of uh, this fragrance or this scent. Love the way how it feels on the skin. It's lightweight, you don't feel sticky. But the best thing about it is that it's drugstore. It's very affordable. And Hawaiian Tropics is overall a really great brand. A product that I find myself using over and over again because it just makes the skin look very glowy, very healthy, and it also does have the SPF is from Super Goop. Now this is called their Glow Oil. It does contain SPF 50. If it contains the SPF 50, why not, right? It also benefits you because it's protecting you from all of those harmful UV rays, which, you know, I'm definitely a sun worshiper. I love being in the sun, but we need to protect ourselves. So the glow oil is great because you can kind of spray it then just apply it on your body and I am wearing it right now. It just gives this very pretty subtle uh, sheen. You could definitely see it but it doesn't look overly greasy and it doesn't feel oily. It feels moisturizing which is one of the great things I love about this. It does have a little bit of a very slight fragrance but it's nothing that's overly strong it just looks very pretty on the body it is on the pricier side i'm super goop so i can completely understand because of the ingredients that they do put in this but spf 50 major major plus only downside i will say about this which i have noticed is that the nozzle tends to get clogged the nozzle actually clogged and it sprayed onto my clothing so best bet apply it onto your hand and then apply it onto the skin just so that it doesn't uh, end up going on your clothing because you guys know how difficult it is to remove any type of oil on your clothing pretty sure this has happened to all of us where you've been out in the sun for a long time maybe you forgot to reapply your SPF and then you end up having some sort of sunburn which is the worst Hawaiian tropics uh, this is called their silk hydration uh, weightless feels as if it's barely barely there coconut papaya fragrance it provides 24 hours of hydration this stuff is excellent because of that aloe it really soothes the skin it's nice and cooling it really soothes that area it also really does help prevent you from going through that whole peeling phase so this stuff is just like holy grail great to have on hand year-round because you never know sometimes uh, it is a little bit difficult to find during the warmer months a lot of us like to keep the makeup a lot more simple just lightweight on the skin and sometimes SPF can kind of get lost in the mix so this is a product which is holy grail status use it year-round especially during the summertime it cosmetics this is their bye bye foundation moisturizer which also contains SPF 50 I'm actually holding up the wrong shade the shade that currently matches me is neutral tan does contain the SPF 50 it's lightweight but it also balances out the skin so say if you have an oily t-zone not gonna make you feel or look like an oily grease ball it's very balancing it does have more of like a satin finish overall it just looks beautiful in photos and pictures and in person you can go very light-handed with it if you don't want full coverage you can go you know just like one small little pump and then distribute it out or you can make it a little bit more full 
extreme coverage, which I have done because I tend to go a little bit heavy handed. The thing that really catches my attention about this product is how lightweight it feels on the skin. It Cosmetics is known for having such wonderful skin loving ingredients. So you know ingredients in here are beneficial for your skin. It's one of those products that's pretty much a go-to, especially during the summertime because it's like that product, I know it's not gonna fail me. It's gonna last throughout the day and it's not going to look terrible at the end of the day. It's still gonna look pretty good. So neutral tan is my current shade and the one year round is neutral medium. Even though this does already contain the SPF 50, it is also really important to reapply some sort of sunscreen throughout the day, especially if you're gonna be out in the sun. A lot of us tend to forget that. I'm also on that bandwagon. So I decided to try out this product also from Supergoop. It's called the Resetting Spray. This does contain SPF 40. I decided just to pick up a small one so I can kind of throw it in my bag, shake it up. And then it also has a really fine mist. You guys see like how fine this is. Mist this over your face and it doesn't ruin your makeup. It won't um, change your makeup. It's just kind of like remisting that SPF do have an oily t-zone so I was a little bit concerned that this might make me feel oily and greasy throughout the day you know after I apply it but to my surprise no it feels very lightweight plus you do not have any of those white dots when you spray it on the face just make sure that you really shake it up before spritzing it on I almost forgot to mention this other product which should have gone before the foundation because again this does contain the SPF 40 it has also reached holy grail status that's just how much I truly Really believe in this product and it's also from super goop this is their unseen unseen sunscreen which does contain spf 40 it's water and sweat resistant for 40 for 40 minutes now the thing i absolutely love about this product is that it does not have any sort of fragrance to it it's also clear which is uh, really great, especially if you don't want to have that white cast a lot of other sunscreens have. Once you also rub it out, it's clear so you don't have any white cast. Also appreciate how this is a moisturizer plus a primer in one. It also helps mattify the T-zone area. It doesn't really do anything for the enlarged pores on my nose. So for that, I have to use some sort of pore filling primer on the pricier side, but you are paying for really good ingredients. But other than that, this is is just holy grail status I know I will keep repurchasing this kind of like that BAM trio you know you need to protect your skin this next one does contain rice powder which is great for oil absorption so if you have oily skin this is going to do your t-zone some justice and I mentioned this June favorites video it's by the brand kimchi chick puff puff pass translucent powder now the great thing about this is that it really helps absorb all of that excess oil it helps mattify it I've been using this just on the t-zone you know one of my besties for the summertime if all of these products are not your jam you know you're not into wearing SPF but you know I'm really encouraging you to apply that SPF as much as you can because your skin will definitely thank you later on the best thing you could do for your skin is just to wear a hat these are some of my favorites um, I've had this one now for a couple of years draw hats with a pink bow detail I'm gonna link everything I'm mentioning down below in the description box really adore the whole bow on the back worn this in the pool at the beach and of course just a regular cap to at least shade your face at least some part of your face is covered from the sun all right chicky so i hope you guys found this top summer essentials video helpful uh please let me know if you guys have tried any of these products what are some of your top essentials whether it be skincare spf an accessory would love to know what your essentials are for the summertime as always chickies thank you so much for hanging out with me for a bit today really really appreciate your time I appreciate you being here if you guys enjoyed this video found it helpful would really appreciate it if you could please give it a like subscribe if you have not already would love for you to be part of the chicky crew thank you chickies so much for watching stay safe and healthy and i will see you in the next video Mwah.